This next story is a gut wrenching reminder to make sure you're properly insured. A Chicago family learned their home policy had lapsed when they needed it most after a devastating fire. The flames spread to their home from their neighbor's property. CBS 2's Lauren Victory looks into the question of why the person next door is not paying for damages. Put it up there. Chief. You're watching a Christmas memory. The Chicago family we made that. never expected these recordings would mean so much. Thank you. The video was taken right there. Boarded up. This is a living room. And uninhabitable. The coach house belonging to Yolanda Redman and her high school sweetheart, Willie White Jr. Don't think that was salvage. May never be available for the holidays again. I heard some hollering and I'm thinking someone's out maybe having fun. Make sure everybody out the house, y'all! Yeah! That night in August, those screams were from a frantic neighbor. Hurry up! Tell them hurry up! Burned beyond repair is the family home of more than 70 years. How much do you estimate it would cost to replace everything? I believe at least 200000 $200,000 that they are on the hook for, even though here a neighbor's trash was the source of the flames, according to this Chicago so Fire Department report. Ignition of rubbish in a city issued plastic garbage can, investigators concluded. It's not our garbage cans, these are yours. A point the coach house owners are desperate to make because their neighbor's insurance provider won't cover their loss. They're not taking responsibilities which is kind of crazy to me. Unfortunately, it's not that crazy because there's something important we should mention. The whites say they didn't realize until the fire that the insurance policy for the six unit building on their property was active, but coverage for the coach house had lapsed. It's critical to pay attention uh, make sure you have insurance. Make Janet Ruiz from the Insurance Information Institute partners with insurers to educate the public. She explains why having your own coverage matters, even in a situation that's not your fault. If the coach house had its own insurance, they would pay the claim and then they would figure all that out and they would collect if they could. <sighs> But as it stands, Willie and his wife are on their own. Is your intention to rebuild? Yes. They'll need to sue the person next door and win if they want reimbursement. An email to the couple from their neighbor's Allstate representative said, I do not see any evidence that my insured caused or contributed to the loss. The location is an open alley. <laughs> CBS News Chicago sent pictures to Allstate's media team because it seemed apparent that the fire started in a driveway, not an open alley. But that didn't change Allstate's mind. Wow. Yeah. Looks like grandma and grandpa will have to make Christmas memories somewhere else, at least this year. Oh, let's go. Lauren Victory, CBS 2 News. Hmm. CBS News Chicago reached out to the neighbor whose garbage cans ignited, and we did not hear back.